Hello and welcome to Conrad Seidel's Beer of the Week. Uh, this week's beer is uh, a beer that uh, my friend Michael Jackson, who passed away about 10 years ago, uh, called the most refreshing beer in the world, Rodenbach Grand Cru. Rodenbach is brewed uh, at a brewery in Roselaer in, in, in Belgium, and uh, it was first brewed by a, a brewer and politician in the 1820s, Alexander Rodenbach. And uh, they still produce in uh, that traditional way where they have the aging process of the beer in wooden uh, vats, large vessels where the beer can mature for years. And for the Grand Cru, uh, they make a sort of a cuvee of uh, a blend of, of uh, beers of different ages, uh, but one third of that beer is the regular Rodenbach, which you can buy as, as, as a fresh beer, and two thirds is aged in these oak vessels. And these oak vessels, of course, they contain lots of, of uh, microorganisms, and, um, and some of them uh, tend to make the beer sour. So when you pour that beer, you see it's unfiltered, you can see it uh, produces a, a, a nice head which will not be very stable here, but uh, looks good. And uh, you, you pick up an aroma which is like aceto balsamico, uh, which is basically uh, uh, acid, it's acidity. Uh, and. Uh, and you get, get this wonderful, refreshing uh, nose to it. it, it, it it's, it's not only the, uh, the, the aroma of vinegar, it's, it's also an aroma of, of maybe sour cherries or, or other, uh, other fruit. It's, it's very fruity and, 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 and sour. And so is the taste. It's immediately refreshing. We're talking about the... 6% beer, so it's, uh, it's not too strong, so you can really enjoy it as a refreshing drink. Starts out sour, then brings you full flavors of, uh, again, fruit. Um, it could be tropical fruit, it could be cherries, it could be it uh, could also be, be apples, there, there's, there's hints of apple cider in it. And, um, and then it's, um, it's very long lasting and there, there's uh, almost no perceived uh, bitterness in there. It's, uh, it's a uh, very, very refreshing and, and, and sour, winey beers. It's like uh, uh, some, some, some good uh, white wines. And so is the food pairing. Like, uh, if, you, if, you, if you're looking for, for pairing for, for uh, fish, uh, be it salmon, be it uh, even lobster, that would be the perfect pairing for those fish dishes. But of course, uh, if you want to drink this as a, as a refreshment, it's, it's basically the, the ideal beer. And Michael Jackson was, was very right to say that. We... Uh, we're, we're, we're lucky. I, I live here in Vienna, and in Vienna we have the Kangaroo. This is the pub where we uh, do all these Conrad Seidel's Beer of the Week uh, shoots, and we have this, uh, this wonderful beer here. They, they, they do have lots and lots of bottles. So if, you, if you come to Vienna, uh, probably it's, it's easier to find that beer here in Vienna than in many other places. Uh, here the Kangaroo pub is the one where I used to drink the Rodenbach Grand Cru. Uh, see you next week for another Conrad Seidel's Beer of the Week. And well, I've got to finish this one. It's it's just marvelous. Mm. Well, see you at the kangaroo, huh? <laughs>